Good morning, everyone. Had a good start to the morning. I encourage everyone, when you first wake up, you know, go do a a 15-minute jog, do a couple push-ups, get your blood going, uh, do some meditation, do some prayer, definitely do some prayer. Always want some protection out here on the road. But other than that, had a good start to the morning. Then I found out my top dasher status was stripped. Apparently, and someone had commented on it and said that you still needed 70%. Uh, you were correct. Apparently, even though they sent me that picture and, and said, congratulations, you are a top dasher. I found out today that they said they sent that in error, So, which is a bunch of crap. I mean, how do you make an error like that? Like I was telling them on the phone, how did you mess up when you saw my acceptance rate was at uh, 15, 16% if it has to be 68%? And all she kept saying was, oh, I'm sorry, we, we never meant to send you that, then we never, and I'm like, you know, this is just ridiculous. It is ridiculous only in the fact for this because it really didn't give you anything other than the ability to uh, start any time that you wanted. And all that did was mess me up for four days. Okay, me thinking that, oh, I don't have to schedule now. I didn't schedule. I just did it the day of. So now I'm back to doing it. I scheduled myself for the, uh, I don't have any hours for Saturday, Sunday, Monday, or Tuesday. But I was able to get some hours on Wednesday. So those four days, I'm just going to have to solely rely on Uber. And then today, I'll make sure to uh, schedule myself today. So whatever. It's like, you know, things. I will say this. If you let things bring you down, you will always be down. Because there's always going to be something in your life that will come up. Or a situation that will arise. Or something that you're dealing with that will make you be down in the dumps you have to be one of those people that say hey you done slowed me down and this has definitely slowed me down but you haven't put me out you know hey i'll rely on uber and i'll rely on instacart which is why i tell you guys again always have multiple platforms that you can maneuver yourself around because you never want to be stuck just stuck on one platform and just to say that in a uh a macro you don't want to be stuck with these platforms period and that's one of the things that i keep harping now that i see one of the biggest mistakes i made was thinking that you can make this money on here and you'll be safe no the only safety is in financial freedom so start sprinting towards that goal your goal is to be out of the rat race and somewhere along the lines i i kind of lost that thinking that oh i'll slowly pay my debts off or I'll slowly put some money away for investments instead of really saying that no I'm giving us a a good opportunity here to really dig myself out the hole you know what let me get to start let me start digging so you guys stay blessed I will get at you guys later take care Yeah, DoorDash is full of crap. Um, Just got off the phone after I emailed them again. Uh, I encourage you guys, even though you may not get the answer you want, you still should always give it at least two shots. I did call once I first found out, like I told you guys in the morning, and I found out they was full of crap. So then I went to the chat, and the chat is in this uh, video. As you can see, the person said I was correct because of the message they had sent to me um they called me because he couldn't do anything on his end and then they called me with the same bs that the first person said and said oh well there's nothing they can do which is just full of crap like i said i've told now it may be true because she said it was computer generated so once that hit my uh screen it just allowed me to have the uh top dasher status So that's what she claimed, that they couldn't do anything. It was all by the computer, which is probably a load of crock, but whatever. Like I said, all I'm showing is that don't just, even if you still don't get the outcome that you want, don't just give it the first shot. Always give it another chance. 
just to see if someone else can do something and it did look like they were going to be able to because the first time I called I couldn't show the picture so anybody can say anything but if you have proof you know they gotta really look and backstep what they telling you and say well we did send them the picture but they couldn't do anything even with the picture probably didn't even care but whatever so I tell you guys I have multiple apps but uh, picking up an Uber and I'll get at you guys a little later. Take care.